So it's really simple in a sense. Uh, oils, most oils, they, they contain about 99% fat, so different types of fatty acids, mm -hmm. and 1% things that are not fat. There are things that are soluble in fat. Mm -hmm. And so, so if you think of it, if, I, if, you want to def if, it, if the oil is refined, has no flavor, no smell, how can you make the difference between two oils? If I tell you it's a grapeseed oil, or if I tell you it's an avocado oil, or it's a cheap soybean oil, it all looks pretty much the same. Mm -hmm. what, what's going to change is the fatty acid profile is going to be different. And then the unsaponifiable, so the things who are this 1% stuff that are diluted in the oil, is going to be unique, or mostly unique, or at least they have some unique features. So what we do in the oils that we get, first we're going to do a peroxide value and a free fatty acid analysis, which is going to tell you if it's you know, the acidity and if it's old or fresh. I tell you, this is the best avocado you ever had. It's literally just soy <laughs> oil, but uh, if you don't do a fatty acid product. Now, the people who are a bit more sophisticated in their cheating will basically try to mimic oils that have very similar fatty acid profile. Mm. So to give you an example, uh, hazelnut oil has almost the exact same fatty acid profile as olive oil. Mm. Macadamia nut oil has almost the same fatty acid profile as avocado oil. Mm -hmm. And so on. Okay, so if depending on market conditions, whatever you can find, you may find that it's more interesting. Obviously, it's the best would be that you take a soybean oil that costs fifty cents a pound and you sell it for three fifty as an avocado. Yeah. And that's like money in the bank. Right. right? So, right. Um, so that's the type of people. So fatty acid profile is a good way. And but sometimes people are really going to be sophisticated and just find the exact same fatty acid profile, like I mentioned. In that case, you're obviously going to go to the one percent and look for something that is very unique to. Uh, and oil. So most of the tests I just described to you, we do internally. Mm. Uh, but some of this unsaponifiable identification, you're starting to be quite uh, sophisticated. 